using the Rhino plugin Grasshopper, you can parameterize models as required. With the RFEM interface, you can export these models live to RFEM. Basic features will be explained in this video. First create a point with the construct point command and copy it three times with Ctrl C Ctrl V. Specify the point coordinates X and Y with sliders, so that they can be easily adjusted later with the slider. Connect the sliders to the point components, and assign the coordinates to the nodes. In the window on the right, all elements are graphically displayed in Rhino. Now insert a line component, and create three more lines using copy and paste. Start and end nodes are then assigned to the lines. Simply also connect the individual components with each other. To create members for RFEM, insert the Glueball component member. You can find it in the Glueball tab, which will be released with the interface in Grasshopper. Connect the line components to the member component and define the member geometry. Afterwards, define material and cross-section using the panel component. Make sure that you use the RFEM terminology. This information is then linked to the member component. To transfer this model data to RFM, you have to insert the glue ball component input to Grasshopper. After connecting with the member component, all members are automatically transferred to the open RFM file. By moving the sliders in Grasshopper, you can see how the interface works. Creating surfaces works on the same principle. Insert a surface component into Grasshopper, and connect the four corner points with it. With the glue ball component for surfaces, you can merge this geometry now with all the information required for RFEM. Like the member properties, the material and surface stiffness can be defined using the panel. Pay attention to use the correct RFEM terminology. Only then it is possible to export the elements correctly to RFEM. In this example, the surface thickness should be controlled with a slider. They can be individually adjusted in Grasshopper. After connecting the properties with the surface component, the surface is exported to RFEM. All changes to the parameters in Grasshopper now have a direct impact on the RFEM model. Utilizing the Rhino software and the Grasshopper plugin, you can parameterize structures as required with a clearly arranged visual programming interface. This makes the product package especially interesting for architects and engineers.